buongiorno, or buenos dias, or actually in this case, buenos noches. Uh, so last night I took Bri out to dinner. I think she liked it a lot. We went to a, uh, a pizza place, I guess you could say. And um, Bri had got some really cool like um, tortellini dish with some kind of like Alfredo sauce and I got me a small calzone. So it was really good. I really liked it a lot and, uh, you know, didn't really get to vlog it too much because there's a lot of people around there and I didn't want to disturb their meals. So, tonight, it's Thursday night and Brie is making me some, some food tonight. She's actually making me a good meal for once. Ah, look at that face. <laughs> Sorry guys, I had, to, I, had, I had to get a reaction out of Brie Brie because this is what I do. I, I, I make like small jokes. And then I like to get reactions out of her. It, it, it keeps it keeps it fresh and keeps it fun. You know what I'm saying? So here is what Bree's making. Check it out. Bree Bree is making some coconut shrimp. Yep. You got the shrimp there. I'm trying to keep a healthier version of the shrimp. It's baked. It's baked. On a little pan there. See that? She puts it in the oven. Bakes it for a little bit. And it makes it nice and crispy because she's using baking something, baking soda, instead of instead of making it um, in the in a fryer, so that it's extra crispy. Take a look at that. All right, so since Breebe's cooking me dinner, I'm gonna I, I poured her a little glass of wine, some uh, some Dago Red, as they say. So got her some Dago Red, Breebe. Check this out. Thank you. Oh, he's right there. Oh, hello. Yeah, that's right. I forgot. Thanks. Yep, got her a glass of Merlot. From our housewarming party still. <laughs> yep, a big jug of Merlot we got going on. So, uh, I'm doing my, my, hu my husband duties. When you get married, that's what you do. You take care of the woman. Woman's happy, you're happy. Trust me. Happy wife, happy life. For all, the, for all the men out there, I'll tell you what. Treat them good, they'll treat you good. Salute to that. Thank you, Tal Bermuda, with a little vacuum interlude because I got cooking on the floor. But the shrimp are done, ready to go in the oven. All right, folks. So here is the Coconut shrimp, yeah. All right. We have some dips over here. What kind of dip is that, baby? It's wasabi, lime, mustard, and um, chili, uh, Thai chili sauce. Wasabi, lime, mustard, and Thai chili, and honey. Wow, that's awesome. And this is what? No. <laughs> oh, it's all the same. Oh, it's two different things, okay. Awesome, there's baby there's mine, there's our wine. And here is butternut squash mashed potatoes, right? No, it's whipped butternut. <laughs> There's no potatoes in it. Oh, whipped? Okay. There's no potatoes in it. It's whipped butternut squash, right? Yes. There we go. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, I would forget my head if it wasn't attached. I'm telling you. I, re I really would. Like this head, it's cool looking. It's awesome. And, you know, I'm a pretty cool dude. But I must say, my head, you can only cram so much in there. So uh, right now I'm about to cram some shrimp in there because these look amazing. Uh, thank you, Bri for making me awesome dinner. Yep. Awesome. All right, guys, I'm gonna enjoy this, and uh, hopefully you will uh, you'll enjoy watching it. And I think Bree is gonna actually post it on her blog eventually too. A nice little the recipe actually. So um, hopefully we'll get get it to you, and uh, you can enjoy it as well. Check it out. All right, it's Friday. Happy Friday, everybody. Um, and I am taking. I took my car to get my oil change this morning, and now I'm taking Bree's car to get her oil change for. Her. So I'm going to uh, hopefully bring it out and get it checked out, get everything done with it. And maybe she, she may need brakes. Hopefully she doesn't, but she drives a lot, so she probably does. <laughs> so I'm going to get that taken care of for her, and I'm going to get my car back. So I'm trading cars. And uh, yeah, so it's lunch break. So I may even stop and get something small for lunch. Um, you know, maybe for Riri, who knows. And uh, I'll pick up my car and we're going to be good to go. What, what, what a Friday already, though, I'll tell you. It's a beautiful day out here. Um, it's sunny. It's 
A lot of good clouds in the sky. It's definitely fall. It's really it's really feeling cool out. So uh, fall time in New Jersey is beautiful. You get a lot of the changing trees and everything's uh, real crisp outside and looking good. So uh, I don't know if you can see, but some of the leaves outside. I don't know if you can see out the window here because it's a little the window's a little dirty from driving a lot, but um, the, the, the leaves are start are changing. If not starting to change, but if not changing all the way totally. This tree, for some reason, didn't change yet, so it's still totally green. Weird. But, you know, it's uh, it's, it's a beautiful time of year. It's one of my favorite times of year. Fall is actually my favorite season, so it's awesome. And uh, Cody's in the window over there. Check him out. Waiting for me to get home. Watching me leave. Always watching from the window. That's the cool thing about this new camera, too, by the way, guys. I can zoom all the way in on him. <laughs> from the car, which is which is kind of cool. So anyway, um, yeah, so I'll, I'll, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. I decided to head to Steve and Tasha's tonight um, to help them with uh, with painting and stuff and with their new house and we're bringing them dinner, a little care pack in the back seat. Um, so uh, we're going to bring them dinner and we're going to help them out and that's what family does. So we're going to help out the uh, the Vitalis with their with their house. It should be a nice, it should be a very nice evening. Um, I got Brie with me, my red dog in the side seat here. <laughs> and. Uh, we're going, to, we're going to the middle of nowhere, guys. We're going to the middle of nowhere, then we're and then we're going further into the middle of nowhere. So, it should be a pretty fun, uh, pretty fun adventure, I'll tell you. Steve and Tasha's house came over here at some awesome dinner and got to see our besties. There's Tatis, Ma, and Brie. Hey! Hi! Look how cute they are. They're so cute over here painting. Yep. Pick Tasha, picking up her roller. Tasha's rolling the walls. We pitch in when people buy houses right now. We do pitch in. Look at that. I'm gonna get a close shot. Look how cool it is. And there's gonna be trim here. So yep. we don't have to be super precise. Yeah, look at Brie, man. Brie, nice. uh, here's a little fun fact. Brie actually cut in our whole house. She did our whole house and for look, us. this is the right brush that you need. Tasha is smart. The Wooster. 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 I mean, not to throw out a brand name, but it really is a good one. Yeah. And then the short handle, you, would, you wouldn't think this, but it gives you a lot of control. Right? Yeah. Tasha don't mess around back there. Look at her. Look at her get look her getting it in. And like look at, just for scale, yeah, let's look how short Tasha is. Yeah, she's she's short. Okay. And she's got this this pole here, man. I think she's taller than me. She's, a, she's working with the pole. She's a mean green paint <laughs> machine. <laughs> working the pole. <laughs> Yeah, she's like doing an awesome job, an awesome job. That's mean cool. green painting machine, that's what she is. Yep. Literally, I mean, that's 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 pretty literal, guys. Yeah, so, uh, looks good, man. I, I love the board on the bottom there, it's cool. You guys have this house coming along, man, for, for a new place. You guys got in here and beasted it out, I'll tell you. Yep. Trying. It's looking good. Boom. Boom, boom, right? Mm-hmm. So, Tasha, how, how, how long did you buy this house again? When did you buy this? When? Yeah, uh, actually, Sunday will be one month, so nice. this is crazy. We've gotten a whopping two rooms done in one month. Hey, hey. <laughs> you know what? I'll tell you, at, you know, in Mike G time, that's good. That's real good, because guess what? Our house was a couple months yep. of the work, so. You guys you know. are definitely helping out by being here yeah, tonight. remember when you guys first came to our house and Steve said it looked like a beach house? Remember that? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, it feels like a beach house in here. I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. opinion. Yeah, you know, I'll tell you. <laughs> that was really funny, though. Oh it's pretty cool, though. I'll tell you, it's it's fun. It's, as you notice, I'm not paying because I'm I'm known to. We call you Gloppy Gus. 
<laughs> Gloppy Gus. <laughs> when, when that come? When that name get made up? When I started telling Tasha how bad you paint. Oh, uh, <laughs> see. See, boys are not it's allowed okay, to paint. Though. It's okay. Yeah, we're allowed to paint. No. So you the guys are just hanging out, you know. You yeah, I, I, I do all the tech stuff. So I, I, I have a digital, uh, digital, uh, front door lock, which I think don't you guys have that too, Tasha? Yes, we do. Nice. I recommend getting one of them, guys. It's, it's pretty good. Re uh, recommend that a big time. Digital locks are a lot better. You don't have to put the key in every time. You just go boop 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 boop. Open. You come home with groceries. Yeah. Yes. Boop, boop, boop. And mm -hmm. you don't have to mess with your keys or anything. It's awesome. Yep. Good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and I think she's coming back with a beer for me. So uh, yeah, just want to give you guys a peek. How cool it is. All right. So so we're going down the basement. So, Tasha, what did you say about the stairs? The stairs are apparently very steep. But they're not really good railings. They're here. illegal. Whoa. This is okay. Well. Um, that means that I gotta actually try. I'm gonna go down these things. If I die, I love you all. What? What are they called? They're called camel crickets. Where we have mole crickets. Yo, they're they're really scary, actually. I didn't think I had that many. Wow, they're scary. They're outside. Yeah, they're outside, but still, yeah. that's scary. But you gotta watch how the they jump. The things you find in basements. You gotta watch how they jump. They're almost impossible to kill. Ooh. Think of all the Christmas decorations in the store down here. Wait, it did it to me again, Tosh. What? Are you, are you all goopy? Where did that come from? That's not watery. Well, I was gonna come in and see how you guys are making out. Um, we're making out well, we're almost done. But this paintbrush is goopy on me, I don't know why. That's not good. Cheers Look at that pretty color. Isn't it pretty? Yeah, nice job, ladies. Look at how Thank professional you. that is. It's really my, you got there? my rum chata. Rum shot chata. It's a reward. <laughs> yeah. No, but the color is really, really pretty with the wainscoting, with the white. Oh my gosh. It's going to look good. I love it. Almost hmm. there. It's 11 o'clock. Almost there. Natasha is very proper and she lets her paint dry for four hours <laughs> before she does the second coat. But if it was me, I'd be going again. But she doesn't do that, so. Yeah. I won't be help here to help them. If you were like Mike G, you'd be painting the second coat before the first coat even dries. When yeah. is Mike G able to You try, it? no, that's All the, the time. That's why he's still happy us, because he tries to do two in one. <laughs> yeah, man, it's called efficiency. He says, if it's thick, I don't have to do two coats. But meanwhile. And that's why I don't paint. <laughs> it's okay, though. Yeah, nice job, ladies. Looking good, looking good, looking good.